lives. There are many reasons that I know that God lives. Mostly experiences where he has miraculously answered my prayers. And I know that if I pray to him, that he hears those prayers. Sometimes it pleases him to help me. Well, sometimes what I'm asking for may not be good for me. But if it is, and I've asked sincerely in the name of Jesus Christ, I will receive it. Let me give you an example. In about 1997, I had just taken a new job at Arizona State University as a database administrator and needed training in Sybase. I had a daughter and her family there in McKinney, Texas, and so I chose to go to Dallas for the training that I needed. And uh, while I was down there, I visited my daughter and her family on um, Santa Cruz Street, McKinney, and they had borrowed a weed whacker from a neighbor and had edged the front lawn. This must have been on a Saturday morning. I'm not sure about that. <clears throat> but I do know that we were looking for that spring. Well, I forgot to tell you. They lost a spring in the uh, weed whacker. I guess when you take it out, take the head apart to put in new line, you can very easily lose the... Uh, the spring, oh, they're, you know, big around as your finger, I guess, and uh, maybe an inch, inch and a half long. They'd lost it on the uh, front lawn, and it was very difficult to find. We looked and looked and looked for that thing, and Finally, everyone gave up, except for me. I, I stayed there, and uh, after everyone went around the corner out of the front you know, lawn area to, to the side of the house, I bowed my head and I asked Heavenly Father, in the name of Jesus Christ, to please help me find that spring. And when I lifted up my head and opened my eyes, there was that spring right in front of me, just as bright as the North Star. I was looking right at it. The first thing my eyes saw was that spring, and it was just as obvious and bright as the North Star. You couldn't possibly miss it. I went directly to it, picked it up out of the grass, put it on my finger, and walked around the corner and showed it to them. They could hardly believe it. But that is an example of how I know that God lives. Just one of some very startling examples. Pray to Heavenly Father, in the name of Jesus Christ for the things you need. And when you get something as an answer to prayer, be sure and give thanks and keep doing it. That's the formula. Ask. If you receive, say thank you. 
and repeat. You will soon come to know that God lives and that he loves you. I really hope you have a good day. God does live. In the name of Jesus Christ, amen.